sometimes in life we need to catch a break, especially after experiencing something so traumatic you feel no one understands. My uh, emotions have changed a lot over the past month. I get sad or I either get mad. AJ was shocked along with Kendall and Gilbert while hiding with Mia in room 112 for 77 horrific minutes. It's like they get me, like they know what I've been through. They're helping me a lot by making me laugh. Who wants to start first? Slowly over the last several months, the joy of laughter <laughs> can be heard again at this home in Uvalde. I kind of like explain it, but it just gives me like hope. This is Mia's home. She was one of the little heroes who was brave enough to call 911. I'm doing okay. But when Kendall shows up at her house, <laughs> her tears are coming out. So do the giggles. Like when I tell her stuff, she understands what I say. When something triggers the horrors of that dreadful day, these children have found refuge in one another. Like if at nighttime they don't sleep because they're having bad dreams, you know, one will call the other one and say, hey, you know what, I can't sleep because it's in this. Then the other ones will be like, okay, are you okay? Do you need something? These classmates and their parents have started to share something. A special kind of bond with them. It's beautiful. She loves coming over here, playing with the kids. They have their own group chat. You know, I didn't know how to get his innocence back. That was taken away that day. And him being here, he's gotten a little bit of that back just because he's with his classmates. It's like they have their own therapy within their self. But now that we've been hanging around with these kids, it's like he's happier. The innocence lost because of evil beginning to return because of hope. Like they're always there to help each other out. And that's good because if something were to happen to me or my husband, at least I know, my son is being taken care of by his friends. AJ told us he and his friends want something simple for the world. To not go through what we went through. And he wants something no child should ever have to think twice about. I want to feel safe. I want to feel like I want to be happy again.